36 headquarters. I got one mail from the back. I saw a window of opportunity. Um, and so I, I took uh, advantage of it. A New Jersey man is lucky to be alive. Oh, no, you too. We never got a chance to talk. Thanks to a pair of heroes, one in uniform and the other in a suit. I saw a tower of smoke. Kyle Anderson, a Woodbridge Township councilman, was driving on Sagamore Avenue in Edison when he saw a house on fire. He pulled over and a woman calling 911 told him that a man was still inside toward the back. I could see there was a door open and there was a gentleman that was struggling. So I went in, helped him out, but he couldn't move any further and I propped him in a seat um, on the deck. At that moment, police officer Joseph Elkimos arrived on scene. When I got out, I saw the fire. Uh, the house was completely engulfed. Where? The smoke was so thick it was nearly impossible for him to see. In the officer's body camera video, you can hear Anderson telling him where the man was. Where's that? With no regard for his own safety, Alchemos went in. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. You know, I didn't even, I didn't even talk to him or anything like that. I picked him up, put him on my shoulders, and I ran out to safety. I put him in, and I, we went to the front of the, the house. With smoke in his lungs and eyes, Alchemos carried the man to safety. But when I got, when I picked him up, I actually saw he was he was all like charcoaled up and stuff like that from the, the heavy smoke. Police say the man is okay. The fire is still under investigation, but it's not believed to be suspicious. The officer was a true hero. He was the one who threw him across his back and because the man really could not move at all. Alchemos was taken to the hospital for smoke inhalation, but he's back on patrol, ready for the next call. When I brought him out, I saw that I was happy to see he was, he was awake and alive. I, I believe that I was to take a chance. Um, I believe that I had the ability to, to go in. Um, um, I saw an opportunity and I knew that if I waited any longer, um, that opportunity, that window, I should say, was closing by the second.